एवरी वन वेलकम टू लर्निंग विद जियो स्नेक्स वी आर बैक विद अनदर वीडियो टूटोरियल टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट विद प्लग इन्स इन प्लग इन्स वी विल गो फॉर सेवरल प्लग इन्स एंड वी विल टेल यू हाउ यू कैन यूज दोज प्लग इन हाउ यू कैन इंस्टॉल एंड वॉट टास्क यू कैन परफॉर्म विद दोज प्लग इन्स सो टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस स्पेसिफिकली अबाउट क्विक ओ एस एम सो वॉट यू हैव टू डू लेट सी फर्स्ट हाउ यू कैन इंस्टॉल दिस प्लग इन गो टू प्लग इन्स विद इन प्लग इन्स गो टू मैनेज एंड इंस्टॉल प्लग इन्स Once you will click Manage and Install Plugins, a new window will appear where you can search for different plugins. Just search for Quick OSM. So we have already installed it. If you haven't, then you can just yeah. So if you want, you can install the plugin from here and then close this. Once you will install the plugin, go to Vector in Vector. you can see that quick osm has been added into your vector layer so what you have to do first uh, we have added a street map for a region of near delhi so why we use basically quick osm uh, when we are working with some data sometimes we need the building footprint or we need some other station location or the railway lines these kind of data we can directly extract using quick osm without going to sites or without searching it over the internet so we can directly extract it using quick osm let's suppose this is a region near delhi and i want to extract the building footprint you can see all these building and now i want to extract all the building footprints exist in this particular area so how i can do that what you have to do just go to vector and select your quick osm once you will select quick osm a new window will appear which will ask you how you can query your data it usually query your data in terms of key and value when you will go to osm maps feature in the internet you will find that all the features are stored in the form of key and value in osm so uh, just we are going for building key is the building now in value you can uh, use like commercial whether you want commercial building you want residential building like this you can use different values for now we are just we want all the buildings so we are keeping this value as empty now what you have to do in this in option you can select how much data you want so we are saying we just want how much is our canvas now what you have to do just run this query once you will run this query it will take a little time based on your internet connection because it has to load uh, a lot of data all types of building and everything so it will take a little time you have to wait for that you can see the process is still going on if your internet connection is very good then it will not take much time but if it is a little slow then it may take time because depend on your extent or the data you want osm to download it will take time now you can see the query has been successfully loaded so now close this and now you can see if you will just remove your base layer now you can see now you have all the layers or the building footprints whether it is a line or a polygon or a uh, point you have all the data in the vector format now what if you want to export it so what you have to do just go any of your layer and go to export and save this feature if you want it in the form of geo json or anywhere and you can save it as building and then you can change the crs if you want and then press okay so that's how basically you do this operation in qgis thank you for today